Okay, hello Gemini's. How you doing? I hope everybody's doing well. We're doing an energy reading for you. Gonna see what's going on in your energies. Okay, like share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video. New viewers, subscribe. I love to you know have you guys as a subscriber. I hope you're having a blessed day. And I hope your day at work was a great one. I hope nobody got on your nerves. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what's going on. Like, share, hit the notification button again. And subscribe. <clears throat> Gemini's energy. Please Gemini's energies, please. Show me Gemini's energies, please. Show me Gemini's energies, please. Let me Gemini's energy. A few more cards. Okay. All right. Let's see. So we have Justice, Libra's energy. We have the Knight of Pentacles, Virgo energy. We have the Two of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. The Two of Cups, Icy Scorpio, Cancer energy. The Sun card. Then we have the Four of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn's energy here. Okay, you're gonna you're gonna have a victory in this situation. Okay, where it took a long time, you had to plan, strategize. Okay, in this situation, you're finally gonna yeah. And this is concerning your stability. You was at a crossroads concerning your stability. All right. So you're going to be moving forward in that situation concerning your stability where you were at a crossroads. You'll no longer be at a crossroads um, in this situation. It could be somebody coming in with an offer to you, but they took a long time to come in because they had to plan, strategize what to offer you. All right, this is somebody that loves you. Um, they they want to be committed to you where maybe in the past they were not committed to you. The sun card is here. This is somebody that took you maybe through a lot of cycles, somebody you had a lot of passion for. And it, it may be a, they may have took you through some things that were like repeated. You know what I mean? The same cycles you 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 had to keep dealing with the same thing over and over with this person this is somebody you had a lot of passion for but they're coming in with an offer all right um this is somebody they've held on to you they they don't want to lose you because um they value you all right you could have seen this person as being very too codependent it could have been too codependent on you But they're coming in. They don't want nobody else. They, they, they fear that somebody else is going to want you. And they're going to come in and start committing to you. Wanting to be committed to you. Where before they weren't even interested in being committed. In anything committed. I see Scorpio Cancer energy. We got um, Virgo energy here. Earth. Libra. You could have separated from this person. Maybe you guys were married. Some of you. But this, this person, you separated yourself from this situation. Maybe you divorced the person. Or maybe you you were thinking about doing this. And before you actually do this, they're coming in. And they're going to express how they feel, what they want. Um, Gemini's energy. Show me Gemini's energy. Show me Gemini's energy, please. Okay, so the Seven of Cups is here. Pisces, Scorpio, Cancer energy. Pisces, Page of Cups. That's a, a Pisces energy. Okay, Seven of Wands is here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Fire energy. We have the Nine of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. We have Leo here, Queen of Wands. Um, the Eight of Wands is here. Sag, Leo, Aries, fire. And then we have Pisces again. 
the hangman. So there's a strong Pisces here. All right. So you're everything to this person. There's no other like you to this person. You're everything to them. Okay. There's there's no other like you. You know. Page of Cups. They're coming in with an apology. Okay. This person's coming in with an apology. Um, Seven of Wands for fending you off. This is somebody that fended you off. When you were trying to probably show them love, you know, they fended you off. All right. Um, Seven of Swords energy. They're up at night worrying about you. You know, they can't get you out of their mind. They can't move forward without you because you're so attractive to this person. They see you as very, very sexy, whoever you are. They, they hold all this passion for you. Okay. So they're holding passion for you too. And they're going to come in and communicate this to you. Coming in with that apology. They're coming in real fast. It could have already happened. All right. And this is to to move forward with you because things are stagnant. Things aren't moving forward with you and them. All right. So they're coming in um, to move things forward with you, to come out of that, to come out of a uh, stagnation, stagnated energy. Wow. I don't know what is going on, but wow. Okay. Getting tongue tied. Okay, um, the four of cups is here. Yeah, they're coming in with an offer. All right. And some of you, this could be a situation where, okay, four of swords is here. Yeah, they're coming in an offer um, so they can heal things with you to move forward in a healing. Okay, some of you, it could be a situation somebody you're dealing with is divorcing, separating from someone else. All right, and they're coming in to you with an offer, and it took a long time for them to come in for this offer. It's like a long time coming. All right, it's like a long time coming. Maybe that's how you're gonna feel, like it's a long. It's been a long time coming, you know. Um, but the, it took. A, they had to plan and strategize how to even come in to you with this offer. Um, they were at a crossroads, okay, in this situation on what to offer you or with someone else. Okay, they could have been dealing with another soulmate. All right. They could have been in a commitment with someone else. All right. The sun car, but you made them happy. They had all this passion for you. All right. They still held on to you, even though maybe they, um, even though they weren't with you, they still held on to you because they value you. Um, they could have been in a, they could be in a codependent situation where they take care of someone and that had them not able to come in to you at a crossroads, uh, seven of cups. Okay. There's no other like you to this person. You're unique, okay? This person that they're with, they can't even compare to you. Uh, page, of, page of Cups is here. They're coming in to you with some type of apology for fending you off, for blocking you. Maybe this person blocked you. Maybe because they were working on the relationship with the person that they were with. They were trying to fix things, and they end up blocking you, okay? But they're feeling bad for that. They want to apologize to you for that, all right, for doing that. And they're up at night worrying about you. Couldn't sleep, couldn't move forward. When they were sending you off, blocking you. You're highly attractive to this person. Maybe you were the mistress. That's for some of you guys. That's for somebody. Not for everybody. Maybe you were the mistress, but they find you highly attractive, beautiful, um, fiery. Um, they held on to you because they had a lot of passion for you still, okay? And they're coming in to communicate with you, you know? How they feel, what they want, all right? They may come in communicating, telling you that they were stagnated. You know, they couldn't move forward because of their finances, all right? Or this person that they were dealing with was holding them back, okay? The person could have been holding back because they had to take care of them. They were codependent on them. I see the energy here that you're dealing with. Um, four cups is here, yeah. So they're coming in with this offer after they get out of this, all right? Okay? Because they want to heal things with you. Or they had to heal before they come in the offer, with the offer. They're going to explain things to you, what was going on in their life, in other words. And with an apology. Okay? Six of Wands. Yeah, this person's coming in to charge for it in a victory with you. After they heal, okay, an offer's coming in to you after this person heals. After they get out of the stagnated situation. All right, they're coming in. You know, after they build their confidence as well because maybe they had to build their confidence maybe something destroyed their confidence but they're going to come in and charge for it in the victory after they work on what they need to work on to get themselves together 
Okay, um, Gemini's energy. Show me Gemini's energy, please. Hmm. Gemini's energy. Okay, so the Eight of Pentacles is here. Yeah, both situations. This person's coming in wanting to rebuild stability with you, and they're willing to put in the hard work to do so. Okay, or maybe this is something they had to do if the person had them in a financial drought. Um, they had to work and um, rebuild their stability as well before they can even come in and charge forward in a victory with you. Okay, Gemini's energy. Okay, I'm going to take these. They fell out. Okay, Nine of Swans. Yeah, this is, whoever they were dealing with, it took them through a mental and physical struggle. This person took them through that, okay? The high priestess, but they hid that from you. They didn't express that to you. All right, but now they freed themselves from that situation or they're freeing themselves or working on freeing themselves from that situation. And they're going to come out and express to you what was going on, like I said. Okay, the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, they're moving forward in a successful new um, beginning of stability. And they want, they want to come in and they want it to be a partnership that they work on with you as they move forward in that new beginning of stability. So this is the offer that they're going to come in with. Hey, you make them, ooh, you make this person happy. They want to build a family foundation with you, right? You're their fulfillment. Right, temperance, yeah. And they, they'll patiently wait on you as well. This person is going to patiently wait until they can get that new beginning with you, all right? They gain insight that you're the one. That you're the one that balances them out. You're the one that makes them happy. Ace of Wands, what did I say? They gain insight. They gain the clarity that they want a successful new beginning with you. That you're the one to have this successful new beginning with. All right? So that's what I have for you, Gemini's. I hope you guys enjoyed the reading. Like, share, um, subscribe. Um, new viewers, I'd love to have you as a subscriber. I hope you guys enjoyed the reading, okay? I hope you heard something you needed to hear to help you move forward. I hope something uplifted you guys as well. Be good. Have a blessed day. All right? Enjoy your week ahead. I'm out. Love you guys.